Hey everybody, Bones here, Bones Garage, just bringing you up to date on what's going on at Bones Garage. So, got this 1967 Dodge A100 van. Um, just finishing up doing all the brake system on it, as you can see here. We got all new brake parts, new shoes, all new return springs, new adjusters, new adjuster cable. Everything is brand new up on the front. We also replaced all his wheel lugs, the bearings in the hub. We also then went ahead and replaced the spring shackles. As you can see, that's the spring shackle right there. Um, that's the spring shackle right there. And it attaches to the spring. We put in new bushings. And then up towards the front, you can see that we replaced both of the U-bolts that hold the spring to the axle. We also replaced both tie rod ends, one over there and one way out over there on the other side. We put in new shocks, new brake hoses, a new master cylinder. We also have a new drag link that we put in right there for the steering. We fixed up all his steering, uh, tightened up the column, tightened up all the steering, tightened up all the shifters, then uh, went to the back of the truck and did basically the same exact thing. We did um, all new wheel studs, new bar axle bearings, new axle seals, new shoes, all new return springs, new adjusters, we went ahead and did the same back here, put in new rear spring shackle, new front bushings for the spring right there. That would be your spring eyelet right there. That's the bushing, that's the bolt that holds it all together. New shock absorber, new brake hoses. If you look right over there, there's the brake hose. So we put a brand new brake hose in. Um, pulled the rear end apart, cleaned it all up, checked everything, made sure it was all good. Some new brake lines back there along the rear axle. Um, then we went ahead and started doing some work on the motor. Found that not only did we have problems with the motor, and if you look right here, that's where the motor's supposed to be. <laughs> As you can tell, it is not there. Um, it's actually in the back. But uh, we found that the clutch was bad. We also found that the motor had many, many problems. So we pulled it out and we're doing a quickie rebuild on it, a freshen up. I'll bring you in the back and show you that later. Alrighty guys, have a good one. We will talk to you real soon and uh, bring you up to date on what's going on with the 67 Dodge A100. Alright, have a good one. Okay, bye.